What's up, Adventure Family? I'm going to cover something today that some other people have asked me about. Uh, they wanted an update on a video that I did about the coach that my wife and I have. And we had some issues with this coach, so we sent it, had it repaired, and most everything got repaired. But I wanna show you what did not get repaired. Uh, with that, guys, let's get started. Okay guys, let me go ahead and start by saying I apologize for the sound quality. You're gonna hear construction going on in the background. We're having some work done at our home and you can also hear road noise. So I apologize for any of the background noise you hear. Okay everyone, so here lies the problem. I'm, I'm gonna try to set it up as best that I can with my cameras. I have cameras setting kind of everywhere I can to try to get the best shot of what's going on. But the slide, whenever it comes in and out, it was actually tearing up the linoleum on the floor. Let me show that to you. You can see right here, this is those marks that you see right here. That is actually roll marks uh, from the roller on the slide. It comes in and it pinches the, or it rolls up the linoleum right here. Let me see if I can get a little bit better angle. Yeah, that shows it a little bit better right there. You can see where it starts rolling here and continues to roll. So we took this to have it repaired and we sat without our coach for probably six months. And they send it, tell, they call us, say, hey, come get it, we're done with it. So I go pick it up thinking everything is fixed. Come to find out it is not. And this is where I have a major problem with prime time and their warranty claims. So let me show you what they've done to try to correct the issue or no, they did not try to correct the issue. Let me show you what they've given me to mask the issue. So what I have here is what they call a slide slicker. You can see it is just a cheap piece of plastic. And when they gave it to me, it wasn't even cut to size. It was just, it was just this real long piece of plastic. And this piece of plastic, let me show you where it goes and how they want it to work and where my issue comes with it. Okay, so this is what I have to do. And I'm gonna try to, to get this the best that I possibly can to where you can understand exactly why I hate this fix. It's not a fix, uh, but let me show you what I have to do. Okay, so first off, this is what happens when you first start rolling it in. Watch the slicker. And that happens 100% of the time. So I'm gonna show you what I have to do to correct that issue. Let me let it back out. So while I'm standing on the slicker, I have to lean out like so and bring it in. And once it starts going in, it'll ride the rest of the way in on that sleeker. But here's the problem, guys. As I'm going down the road, this slicker does this. It bounces out, and it normally ends up somewhere over here. Okay, so this is how it looks. Go by, Miles. This is how it looks when we have been riding down the road for a while because as you can see I can move it underneath the roller because it's not actually sitting the roller is not actually sitting on that slicker it's actually riding just above it so you say okay well what's the problem with that why does it bug you so bad well here's the problem as we're riding down the road that slicker comes out and as it comes out and stays that way for a while, 
the slide will settle in some and that roller comes back down and it sits on the linoleum to where I can't get that slide slicker back under it. So what do you think I have to do? I have to let the slide out, roll the linoleum even more to the point to where it's just paper thin at this point. So I try to keep it smoothed out and I try to do my best to make sure that I minimize the damage as much as I possibly can, but it still happens. And for prime time, they say, hey, that's the fix. For me, if they would have ever told me when I bought this unit that every time I let a slide in or out, I'm gonna have to put this ugly piece of plastic down and stretch my body out to hit the in out on the slide. You know what I would have done? I would have walked out of this coach into some other coach uh, to where they would, where I would not have had to do that. But guys, I'd like to hear your opinion on it. Uh, I'd like to know how you would fix it if it belonged to you. How would you fix it? Put all that down in the comment. I'm anxious to know. I really want something to where I do not have to put this stupid piece of plastic down every time I let my slide in and out. So I'd like to know what you would do to fix this if this was your coach. Put that down in the comments. Okay guys, that's enough complaining from me. Uh, I don't want it to be a, a gripe fest. I just wanted to share because some people ask, I wanted to share uh, what the outcome was of the repairs that were made. So that's it guys, everything else was okay i guess it was okayly done uh, i'm not going to complain about that that's the only real complaint that i have um so that's it guys that's that's my prime time crusader okay guys that's it for me today remember guys if you're enjoying the content that i'm putting out please remember to hit that subscribe button and then a little notification bell that's right there to the side of it hit that little notification notification bell as well Guys, also remember to give me a big thumbs up. That goes a long ways into helping me get more subscribers. So please remember to do that, uh, that thumbs up. Other than that, guys, I look forward to reading your comments. And always remember, if there's an adventure that you want to do, seek that adventure out and go live it. Have a great day, guys.